Right, here we are. Oh, Monday morning. Oh, what a morning. So cold. Look at that mist. Yeah, I've had to be in and uh, get some petrol. Um, hope you've had a fantastic weekend. Um, I did get to Haywards. It was torrential rain all the way there and uh, most of the way back. I <laughs> know. Um, and it tipped down all the time I was there, so I couldn't even do any filming. I know. Um, but what a marvellous uh, meet it was. Yeah, plenty of bacon sandwiches to go around and a wonderful turnout, considering the weather was absolutely atrocious. There was uh, loads there. Yeah, so it keeps going through winter, so make sure you get to still go. Yeah, uh, Jerry turned up on his beezer. Yeah, marvellous, marvellous chap, marvellous bike. Um, uh, hope you've enjoyed the videos. <laughs> yeah, the um, Triumph Trident, what a wonderful bike. Um, and uh, the, the rocket of course yeah and there's more on the rocket to come I know including a two up with Mrs Tame of course um, but anyway oh, that, that's enough of that um, the weather's been atrocious hasn't it let's be honest flooding cars dotted about everywhere these back roads have just been littered with cars and of course everyone trying to avoid the A14 it's been absolute carnage, crashes everywhere. Oh, oh the world has gone mad. Yeah, uh, these roads are now twice as wide as they used to be and covered in mud and gravel. I mean, just look at it. Wonderful. I mean, f for us motorcyclists, this is just an absolute nightmare. I mean, look at that. It's just crazy. Um, I think down here as well, the road is actually closed. Um, but anyway, let's get on to photos. Uh, now, I have got quite a few Halloween photos, which will mainly be done on Friday. But I've got one or two in here as, w as well. Yeah. So, But anyway, I'm going to start with Ian. Ian Hughes, Courses in Wales. I, of course he's at a place I can't pronounce um, but he did also go to a place I can pronounce Barmouth yeah wonderful photos first one's somewhere else second one's back at Barmouth yeah um, fantastic photos now is this road closed here do you reckon let's have a look well it doesn't say it is so we can keep going so we will and have a look what sort of state it's in anyway yeah uh, thinking about obviously Bertie's having to pick up the slack from the SV being off so uh, yeah he's going to have a tough time um, but on that very subject JS said he got reversed into by a bus and he sent us a picture of his Tracer 9 and it makes me feel exceptionally lucky and I mean um, I mean what can you say just look at that it's just a mess isn't it um, brilliant uh, also got a photo from WB yeah, over there in Holland, went to Mission, the Mission Bell B-17 Memorial on his ST-1300. Look at that, wonderful, wonderful photo. Yeah, have to do a bit of research on that. 30 miles an hour, it says, so we better go steady. Um, yeah, wonderful. Um, also got a picture from IT. Um, I do like seeing the mist. Yeah, uh, IT's obviously 20 miles an hour. 20 miles an hour, Bertie. Um, 
he's out of action under doctor's orders but he sneaked out anyway um, unfortunately he's got an issue with his classic 500 first time in four years so uh, he had to go back and he got on his uh, Benelli which is marvellous isn't it I mean just look at the mess they've made of this road honestly um, yeah marvellous pictures uh, I think that yellow field is rape IT I'm not sure I don't know it could be anything in Australia can it are you oh he's waiting for me um, yeah great photos also Jerry at the meet he said I'll send you a picture of my T150 uh, with the square tank a bit like the Rocket 3 BSA yeah um, and he did yeah marvellous picture marvellous looking bike yeah uh, wonderful um, and of course ah uh, ah uh. Uh, uh, down there in New Zealand um, always first generally first not always he's been pipped a few times uh, he has slipped but he's back on form again um, I sent us a picture of his trident he's been out on his trident and I don't know if there's been a flood or something but that little <laughs> Fiat is it a Fiat 500 one of the original ones lifted up look at that brilliant fantastic photo um, also Foxy on the Halloween theme his garage is haunted yeah uh, uh, there's also a giraffe involved look at that brilliant Foxy love it fantastic photo I'm very ghoulish I've got to say yeah brilliant um, CD sent us some pictures last time do you remember with the Hurst and that out on his Oh god, this road is also terrible at the moment. Lots of gravel, so I've got to go steady. Um, yeah, CD. More pictures of his marvellous continental in splendiferous green. On his, uh, he goes around looking at churches. Yeah, hunting churches down on a continental. Wonderful. Um, oh, TB sent us some wonderful pictures of his Speedmaster yeah it's in the uh, in autumn in all the autumn colours absolutely wonderful um, but also with a ghost yeah <laughs> marvellous excellent photos um, hopefully they've gone through now and now I do have quite a few photos from my mate Aid yeah he's been to the Haynes Motorcycle Museum I've never heard of it never been uh, it's not a motorcycle museum it's just a motor museum but he took some photos um, uh, of some of the bikes uh, mainly Triumph and BSA yeah so they'll be running through now uh, probably at the AA BSA right now but um, he also said they have um, a big board that has a thing about you know you write your answers on what bike do you wish you'd kept and all that lot um, a very good idea um, I might answer those I didn't have time this time but I might answer those yeah that'd be a good thing wouldn't it if we could have a list and you could all let me know which bikes you missed and we could see which one's the most popular yeah brilliant photos anyway hopefully they've gone through um, uh, Charlie also sent us a picture of a Triumph bike yeah look at that apparently oh, next to nothing what do, I can't remember how much something like 150 quid for the tank and oh, something else the exhaust or something like that I can't remember off eBay yeah look at that that's wonderful isn't it um, also got what is that don't know what that was um, uh, my mate Tom you know Tom down in Australia he had the 
classic. Then he had the interceptor. Then he had the baby. I know. <laughs> um, but funnily enough, he's got rid of the interceptor now. Um, Yeah, it is 40 miles an hour, I know. Aubrey nice upholstery. Wonderful. Yeah, so if you know Aubrey nice upholstery, overtaking a motorcycle doing 40 miles an hour in a 40. Yeah, anyway. Oh. What can I say? Yeah, Tom. Yeah, he lost his keys anyway. Um, and he ordered a, a new one this was for when he had the interceptor ordered a new one from Hitchcock's went out and found them someone had tied them to this look marvellous and there's Boothy's dog in the background <laughs> laughing his head off brilliant um, uh, Oh yeah, that's what that's what I was gonna say. Yeah, anyway, he's gone and got himself a classic 350. Yeah, marvellous. Brilliant. Oh he's gonna be so chilled with that now. In fact he's already been out uh, and it's already made friends with this Continental 535. Yeah, brilliant. Um fantastic photo. Um now, here's some photos for you. Um, they're from PW. Yeah, PW uh, has been out and about doing some sunset photos from the wonderful California. Yeah, marvellous, dead jealous. Anyway, it's, uh, they're getting all pumpkins and stuff, giant pumpkins, and they've been pumpkin carving look at this absolutely wonderful uh, giant pumpkins carved an elephant a giraffe all sorts look at it absolutely unbelievable fantastic photos um, yeah just brilliant PW what craftsmanship they normally do it out of ice but he got him to do it out of pumpkins yeah wonderful um, and then we're all oh, right so I've got loads of ghoulish uh, photos from JH yeah also uh, over there in the States um, I'll just put a few up today um, uh, because there are a lot of, uh, they are wonderful I mean over there you really know how to do Halloween that's all I can say it's just brilliant I mean look at them uh, fantastic bike as well by the way and a giraffe and a giraffe I know whoa that's just wonderful but I tell you what um, that's about it for photos um, because this mutt has gone on a bit too long already um, I did want to go through some videos but I don't think I'll have time because not because I haven't actually got time I have got time um, but the because I started from a further distance it, the video is going to be too long so yeah so what I will just mention um, I will mention um, let's go two wheel willy uh, selling his super meteor if you want a super meteor special willy deal apparently don't know what that means but um, message uh, uh, to Will Willy yeah get over and have a look at his channel um, he's going to come and live up here in Suffolk with us yeah marvellous um, he'll be able to go to Two Wheel Tuesday and all that lot uh, Stonham Barnes um, oh, just everywhere it would be marvellous um, and and uh, Stephen Woodman Dix, yeah, the Norfolk Thunderbolt. Uh, news there, update on that. Uh, the bullet is sold, yeah, marvellous. That means, I'm guessing, he's gone and bought 
another motorbike yeah um, absolutely wonderful and I think Volcanic Brown has bought it which is wonderful as well so we'll see more of it yeah more of Puppy there you go anyway look I've babbled on enough I know I've only mentioned a couple of videos of course there are those that I mentioned in the photos Ian Hughes morning sir yeah it's miserable old git um, Ian Hughes videos of course Fox's videos of course um, and of course a bold play review oh and I tell you what Exeter Rider uh, morning giraffe yeah Oh, I nearly forgot him. Uh, that would have got me in trouble. Exit to Rider. I said some other motorbike. Did I say a Tenere or something like that? I don't know. I must have got it completely wrong. I knew exactly what he'd been reviewing because I watched it. <laughs> it's a, <laughs> it's not a, it, it's a Transalp, of course. Um, but now he's comparing all the Honda 500s because there are a lot of them, aren't they? Now uh, they've got everything covered at that with Honda. Um, and of course saddlebags uh, part two of the green lane in yeah wonderful um, oh there's just so many I haven't got time so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna say ta-ta now yeah uh, hope you have a fantastic week weather's a bit on and off but we are in autumn it is getting cold um, and I did go out yesterday up uh, to Norwich to Infinity Motorcycles um, and bought some new winter clothing yeah um, after the soaking I got on Saturday I've realized that my current selection of wet weather gear has gone home yeah I don't like to pay much you see it's done two years and I've been really really pleased with it but yesterday uh, not yesterday Saturday um, yeah it let go and I was pretty pretty wet the only thing I haven't got yet sorted are boots yeah anyway ta -ta, I've gone on have a night I know um, have a fantastic week and ride safe if you're out and about and watch out for the state of the roads after these floods yeah ta ta